girl KIRB3YZ and I am back with another video. You already know. Today I'm just going to show y'all a side of me that y'all really don't get to see that much on this channel and everybody knows that I am a cartoonist. So I know y'all are probably wondering where did it start, how did you start, etc. So today I'm just going to make this an art video so we can get a little bit more familiar with where I started and all that. So I'm just going to show you a little bit of my art and my equipment that I work on for the animation. So let's do this! But before we do that, make sure you subscribe to your girl's channel. It's going to be down there somewhere. Just go ahead and subscribe because you know you want to. And hit that notification bell. Alright, let's get started and I'm going to show you all my art real quick. So I'm going to bring you all with me. First, when I was like, maybe... This is when I was a kid, really. Me and Alicia, aka Panda Oreo, used to literally like draw our stories with marker and all that. Strictly with marker. And you see these dots? These dots would represent like the age. <laughs> this is how we started y'all. Like you gotta start from somewhere. We used to literally do all these stories in journals. Random journals. And then over time, um, over time I got better. I think this is when I was like 12. 11, 12, 13 years old or something like that. I used to make storybooks and till this day I still want to make an official published storybook and I have my characters. You'll see. Remember these two faces. Remember these two faces, right? And I'll show you at the end of the video. These were the stories of twins and then I have my other character, April. Then I have um, April's from this story I made. This is literally a story that I made in sixth grade, so I have yet to finish it. I have yet to finish that, um, actually make it. Actually, no, sorry. I have yet to publish it, so look out for that. And then I have my other character, Charlie. Charlie has been with me since sixth grade, my dude. Like, I have a story, I have about three stories of her that I made. But way before then, let me back it up. I entered in like contests, this is very old, and it was like an illusion to where your eyes are on your glasses. I know, I know. But I won first place for it though, so that was when I was in fourth grade. And then once again, Charlie, and I used to do different stuff in sixth grade. I used to draw all the time. Another piece that I did. I was making fun of my stepbrother at the time when he was a teenager and yeah <laughs> I always wondered like what he would be like going in to school just waking up dressed like this. I used to make the oh my god I made fun of him but yeah I won first place for that one too and this is my art now alright this is my art now I have my character Benson he's the iguana Holler is actually from my old stories when I was in sixth grade or whatever. So yeah, look at all this. <laughs> look how far we had to come. And I had to really redo him. I had to evolve some of my characters, especially Charlie. I have grown, y'all. Like, look at that versus that. Like, come on, man. And I did a Halloween picture of him. And I have more Halloween pictures over here. And then I um, was getting into caricatures. So these are actual real people that I know. Alicia. I did that as her Christmas present, but she hasn't framed it yet. And these are caricatures of people that I've been doing. Now I'm going to show you all my equipment that I use to draw my digital drawings. Okay. This is my baby. This is my baby baby oh this is my baby this was about four hundred dollars it was very oh I had to wait so long to get this but I am like in love with it because it comes with like this holder for the pen on the back I love it and this you can actually put at the very edge of your desk I know y'all probably seen it in my vlogs if you haven't watched my Kirby Z vlogs go watch it because it actually has the unboxing of this yeah this is my laptop that I hook it up to. So the screen is black because it transfers to this, so it's a monitor. It's a drawing monitor, so until it's a cheaper version. It's a cheaper version than the whole um, Wacom 
Cintiq, which is like a thousand to two thousand dollars. No, we ain't doing that. I hope y'all enjoyed that video. I'm actually glad that I got to show y'all that side because I don't really show my cringy art like that, let alone my history from way long time ago when I was six up to now. So y'all got to see some of my work and my equipment. So hopefully, you know, y'all can take some tips and be like, oh, okay, well, she used to suck and look at her now. <laughs> and make sure that you follow me on my social media. It'll be right here all in this empty area next to my head okay and it's also going to be in the description box below you can check out my website look at the shirts go to the merch all that and i actually have some of this art on my website so if you want to check out some of my old cringy art on there you can take a closer look at that i gotta put all this stuff up until then creators i love you Mwah. and i'll see you later